if you were to ask American Crystal Sugar as an example that was there today, they, they clearly have a problem hiring maintenance technicians and those kinds of jobs are in demand. But uh, I spoke with Red River Electric the other day and invited them, they couldn't make it, but he said, yeah, it's, it's really hard to find people. And Manufacturers across the country are facing a huge hurdle. They have plenty of job openings, but not enough skilled workers to hire. It's a problem that's hitting close to home where companies in the FM area have noticed the shift. Tonight, Valley News Team's Melanie Palmer has our story about the lack of students going to trade schools. I, I was hiring people all the time too, and, that, and by doing that, um, got me to look at how I wanted technicians to, or what I wanted them to know before I hired them. Richard Weber teaches diesel technology at Minnesota State Community and Technical College. Back in the day, he did a two-year program himself, and he's well aware of a skilled trade shortage. Oh, absolutely. I, I experienced it when I was out in the field. And he's far from the only one. A recent study shows nearly half of manufacturers say their biggest challenge this year is finding skilled workers. And that same shortage is getting attention from a U.S. Senator. You have um, a very low unemployment rate. A lot of people have jobs. But then you also have a real gap between the companies that are creating great jobs and the people that have the skills to fill those jobs. But M. State Moorhead is working to fill that gap. G.L. Tucker is the executive director of Workforce work Development work Solutions at the school. He says all the students in the electrical, plumbing, and diesel technology departments have jobs before they even complete the program. We kind of went through a period where we needed to go to four-year college. Now we're kind of with the debt, and that was brought up today in the meeting, as you could tell, and there were questions around that and that student loan debt. And, and so now you can go get a trades degree here at M State for less than $6,000 of tuition a year. And that couple grand can take you a long way. The average skilled trade job pays about $55,000 a year. Research shows people with career and technical educations are more likely to be employed than people with academic credentials. In Moorhead, Melanie Palmer, Valley News Live. More Americans are attending four-year colleges than ever before, and research shows around 90% of millennials who graduate high school attend college within a couple of years. But some high schools are trying to give students more options when looking at post-grab plans, such as technical trade jobs, to try and help fill the gap.